Alrighty, welcome back. Okay. I took a look at Auntie Ethel. I was recording an episode to see if we can get her. Um, I think we're going to need a rest if we're going to get her at all. And it looks like after either one or two rounds of combat, then she gets like, breaks everything and gets out of there no matter what, teleports away. Now maybe, so maybe they fixed some stuff from early access, but I like had her silence and completely boxed her into a corner with Lazelle, Carlac, and uh, Feronia. And she still was able to break out. But if I have a long rest, Tasha does work on her. Whole person does not work on her. With a long rest, I um, might be able to deal with her. One interesting thing that I noticed before, I put away um, my backpack because it was so much weight into the chest just to see if like okay if i put all my supplies in my main supply chest can i just take a um whenever i try to take a long rest can i use those supplies and the answer was no it won't and it would not even let me pick it up after i took it off because it said it was too heavy so i had to put it on carlac so hopefully she doesn't like leave my party with all my supplies we're gonna have to reload if that happens but lazel and carlac um now, this is kind of my fight crew here. I don't have Shadowheart. I don't think we're going to need her, from what I remember. For some major checks here. But she has, like, no spells, so... Oh, they put these boxes here. That's interesting. There weren't any there before, I don't think, and I'd use Lazo if you want to jump up here and try to break in and get in that way. I can't remember. That might actually be better. What the? F Interesting. I close blueprints. Did that just blow up this ladder, that trap going off? Dude. to bring in Shadowheart to detect that.
me out. So I can use Lucky here. Figured out that Lucky doesn't work. Like, you can't use it on spell checks. At least it wasn't working for me. Like, it was not allowing me to re-roll, like, Tasha hits. Okay. I probably, I probably need to bring in Shattered Heart. Short sword plus one. Blacksmith notes. Infernal iron. Okay. That's it. Infernal metal. This can help Damon patch up my engine. Okay. Does that weigh a lot like 50 pounds 26 okay so you can i can maybe blow ethel up with this too i mean if you have a bunch of these it's up to 34 damage I, I don't want to cheese it too much with like a bunch of like blowing up stuff, but I don't know, maybe. Okay, let's. Let's take Astarian out for now. Wait, is he even. I don't even know where he is in this setup. Oh, he's way over there? Where is that? That's in another room, okay. It's hanging out in here with withers, okay. Need something? Uh, darling, I'm hurt. Uh, I'm it's okay. No one back home will ever believe this. Uh, I don't want to use like a health potion. Just like, you know, hope that I don't get hit. We're so low on all the resources without taking a rest. Oh, not her. Okay. I'm not used to her oh, wearing that helmet. Enough, aside from the obvious. <sighs> Alright, some company. Also, take that goof for like. Whoa, what did, what happened with her? Daughter of Darkness. Um. Unusual search of pain emanated by a tiny unhealed wound in her hand. Okay. Um. not telling me right now how she feels. But let's... Where's her... There, inventory. Hide that helm. There we go. Still alive, Thought she was like Lizelle for a second. Okay. Chest kind of floating. 
So you've got everything. Oh, I haven't read that uh, have a lot on my mind. No, blacksmith right. thing. Is that sh it's a short sword? Okay. I could put that on uh, a Starian, I think. Okay, send that. I've got a long road ahead. Zero to nine Warhammer. Huh. Is that better than these axes? That's plus one weapon, plus one weapon, and tears protection. I doubt it. Unless I need that type of weapon to break this wall. Come on, let's go. <laughs> Immune to slashing. Okay, maybe we do need the Warhammer for that. can throw it too, I guess. I guess we can dip, but it doesn't last for that many turns, I don't think. Never wanted the easy part. Giant webs. They'll alert their spinners with a mere touch. Didn't tell me that in the pre thing. So that's how I came into this area before. Um, I'm thinking there might be a better way. Enough space. Oh, you can just literally climb up. Okay, sure. Okay, I, th I think it's gonna go down once we get in there, so. I'm gonna not be super greedy and just drink like one of these. Okay, and then I guess I needed her to see that wall to break down. I couldn't remember if there were any items in there. I guess I didn't really need it. Um, I hope there's not like an easier way to dismiss these guys back and forth. I wish there was. You could just change them oh, out. Maybe there is. I just don't know. If, if you're sure. Fine. No one stopped me yet. Okay. And then. Historian. He did some serious damage to Ethel, yes. though. He hit her like. Missed with his main hand, but his offhand hit her, like, for 20 each or something crazy. I mean, I did, like, 60 damage to her in a round. It's hard to do the full, like, 130, though. Darling, like, she I has to be CC'd, I think, for a round. I need two rounds so I can probably get her. At this level. Okay. Oh, interesting. Um, 
let's put the right weapon on her before we get into combat here. Lazelle is just like, yeah, I'm in. Let's go. I think there's like two or three ways you can get in here. This is one. Obviously, the other door is one. And I think you can go in through the well, strangely enough, and that's one right here. That well bucket will take you up. I'm not sure how that's supposed to work, but... I have anyone that has a fire. Does she have a fire cantrip? No. Ooh. Is that gonna matter? What's the story? I don't know. We'll see. So, like, on these webs, at least on early access, you could catch them on fire and, like, spiders would fall and take fall damage. What the hell is that? Edder cap. I don't remember those. Infested. What does infested mean? Oh. When hit by a melee attack, spreads to the attacker on death, it spreads to all nearby creatures. Oh. That's actually pretty obnoxious. Is this also infested? Okay, that is not infested, so... Okay, maybe I do remember the edder thing. How many are there? There's one, two... get down here without touching any webs. I kind of want a Starian up here, though, firing. I mean, they'll come to me if I fire on them. But I just don't know. Can I do this? I, like, pull in the whole room. damage to say this thing is. Target outside normal range, high ground. Okay, so if I take this off, 85%. Chance to hit, but like, how much damage is it? Four to nine, sixteen to thirty-one. God, that would just about one tap him if I can get him. I can just get within normalized range here. Can't have disadvantage. How am I disadvantaged? It's just, okay, so it's just allowing me to have my normal attack, but not my sneak attack. Does it? Okay. Oh, he does have Firebolt. Okay. 
So not great that I have to use one of those, but um, okay, hold up. Where passives? Okay, take off the massive clap, and let's see. Can I still? Still says I can't have disadvantage. Do we just go down there? I mean, I can jump up and attack the things on the web or fire the web. It's just going to pull those three. I think if I hit anything in here, it's going to pull the whole room. These are webbed. I'm not going to be able to, like, jump down right here without... How did I climb up before? Because I climbed up here. Uh... Was it right? How the hell did I get up there? I don't remember that tunnel there. Um, right here? Assuming I can't jump into that. Is right here okay to jump without fall damage? Don't you step on that, Lazel, I swear to God. I was going to try to keep Astarian up there, but... Time to press ahead. I don't like not being able to see them all. But maybe I can get high ground over here and just open on this, dude. sharpshooter all ends 75% how much oh, that's a web right there I think I could go for a good meal how much is this gonna do great weapon master all in no way it only does 6 to 16. It's got to do way more than that. Now, she has reckless attack, so that doesn't matter as much for her. Ready for anything. I think we just open with a star in here. So I one tapped him. <laughs> the Starian. Um, now they are surprised, so I guess they don't know where I am.
What do I even have with her? Just shooting? I mean, I guess I've got Vicious Mockery. Oh, I've got... No, I don't have Flames. Okay. Enter turn. We're already in turn base mode, bro. I guess I just say in turn. Ballin'. I don't quite see far enough. I don't know how I can get any more shots on him. I guess down here? I'm not gonna be super advantaged. Maybe like here next turn. What are we doing here? What are we doing here? What are we doing here? Just stop. You're making me sweat. Quiet. This is so weird and seems buggy. If I don't one tap this thing, it could be a problem. I don't know why it's. I guess it's because it's outside of range, it's not letting me. Why is it costing me a bonus action, too? Oh, because like double shot is turned on or something? Feels a little gamey, but... See, it was a lot easier to do this type of thing in the early access, because hiding was a bonus action for everybody. Uh, but it kind of, like, it kind of fits with the thief. I guess it's just going to double shot. I guess you have a chance right there before they react. They take two hits, so if you kill them, then... Okay, so that makes sense why I hit that one for, like, 40-something. Oh. I guess my foot grazed the web. We're gonna have 
have to go elsewhere to get to the rest of them. Yeah, so this was not nearly as clean. Okay, they redid this layout a little bit too, I think, in the initial one. Step in the web, way so. Thank you, Richie. I can't waste any more time. Don't waste a step. Keep it low. Hey, good looking. Do that just wake them all up? Let's have some coffee. <laughs> Outmaneuver them. I can jump up there with him. Quick and quiet. With every breath, a purpose. We shouldn't linger. That's I think that's new. I remember. Mm, can't shoot down on him from there. So it's gonna see me <laughs> if I fire from here, I'm pretty sure. Maybe not. I am hiding. I mean, if I one tap it. Let's not get caught off guard. What's cooking? Make sure we're in range to like jump over and. Let's go for two more shots, or... Okay!
Oh yeah, I was gonna put that on Astarian. Four to nine, one to six. Short sword, short sword. Why? Why does it say it's so little damage? I don't know. Must be something goofed up. Uh, Zolf, start Justicars. Dragon's Horde. I hope for just how much gold I have. Um. Back it up, bro. Someone there. Yeah, get that. <laughs> Come on. Disturb that web. That might be bad. Okay. Oh, this was this the path I took? Maybe this is the path I took. There's like multiple paths you can take to get over to this uh, conveniently super webbed up area with a glowing purple thing down there. Um. up here skeleton I almost step on some of these webs but I think I already triggered everything that's close by hopefully let's get back down here I don't think there was anything else oh phase spider the backpack over here Okay, the other enter was up top. Simple toxin. Stayed interesting. What's even causing that toxin? Oh, what? The potion. Can I? Damn it. Can we just like take some from it? Examine? Back it up, back it up, back it up. No, back up. 
shoot it. Some green crystal. How do I, uh... I don't understand how I'm supposed to, like, interact with it. Old backpack. Great sword, it's good. I guess I'll pass on the shield. We already have so many. Whatever, I stick it. It's like a couple gold. And it's got a skull and a bronze necklace. Yeah, okay. So I can grab some of these things. Assuming I can't really walk that much further down there. Okay. Malachite. Can I grab that malachite? Okay. Let's go into this lab. Actually, Stay out of sight. really. Oh, I can walk. I can go down through there, I think. Okay. Maybe that's how I got up and down. There's a little crack on the wall or something. Or these little cracked rocks. place was different. Burnt journey. Pen and blood, this crimson script has been smeared away in several places, right in the recall of life surface, true clean, waited in the shadows. Spider Queen herself. Feels like I should have uh, Shadow Heart with me for some of these. Same thing, religious. Um, and the Queen's image. No longer will I be bound to this lily form, this base shape of organ and bone. I found the house of Lalith. I shall be its matriarch. Surfaces. Okay. Um, 
Mother Dark Mother, I woke to a gift wrapped in spider silk pair of boots. Corpse of Trial sigil scarred upon his face and a right no man's her. So that spider is actually a person that was like a wizard trying to become a spider. That's, that's an interesting. Well, sorry, minor spoiler. There is a big spider down here. But I didn't... I don't... This war might have been here. I just don't remember. I'm like 99% sure this is added. As I do not remember seeing this. Okay. Time we have. I think we have time for a fight here as long as I don't wipe. Okay, I guess I won't be a little picky and I'll use one of these potions. Right, that was a good roll. Okay, so there's a couple ways you can get in here. I can either try to get in through here. And see if I can pick one or two of these spiders, because in the pre, there are like two medium spiders through here. Or I can just go up top here and just fight right here. She does have... I'm trying to remember, does she have fire? Who had the fire? Astarian? Yeah, that takes a full action, but it'd definitely be worth it in the right circumstance. Wait. Okay, yeah, that. Okay, I'm going to save it and see if I can pick one of them. webs on it. This thing is not patrolling at all. I can try to come up here and just snipe it out. pretty close. Oh, 
god. Alright, so they are surprised though. Okay, she's got 162 HP. Now he's the only one in combat right now. <clears throat> I think I just try to back it up here. That's a lot of freaking eggs, too. Oh my god. I think, okay. We've got spells that can deal with that, in theory. But, I don't have enough spell slots. Ray, what are you doing, honey? It's really late. Okay, why don't you just lay down for a bit? Do what? It's gonna be morning in just a little bit. Stay behind this. Alright. This could get a little rowdy. In the base game, it was three. But there were two phase fighters, the medium sized ones. It was three per stack. There's like two stacks of them. There's a second one over there. She can wake those up too. What if I can, like, pop shot those from here? something I didn't think about before. It's going to take me out of stealth if I do that, though. No, it doesn't let me aim for it. I've only got one Tasha here. What's my Tasha percentage? It's not going to tell me. Can I see her stats? Stats. 
Wisdom is 12. Dex pretty high. Strength's pretty high. Seven each. A cleave. I think I've still got one or two cleaves. Be quick. So they're coming to look. Is Big Mama gonna come? Oh, since hidden presence. that target too far but this one is not I guess because it's lower elevation this thing might see me straight up off of that yeah okay well I got all of those out of the way I guess I could have taken shots on it and then run and hid. Damn, I didn't think of that. Because it reset all my actions. Oh my god, there's some down there too? Holy... Bruh, what? Okay, so that's why I need to take, let me see, spell book. I need to ask about that so these little spiders don't trigger my repost. Okay, so I still should have a cleave. How much does cleave do? Eight to 14, okay, so that should kill Wait, am I aggro? Sort of. Swift and lethal. Time for a cup. Seriously, no, I should have an action again before they do, and I should be able to burn this web and kill all of them, I think. Oh, I 
she could jump over there and spawn all those too. Maybe they've improved the AI where they do that more. Well, I used a great weapon. Oh, this is my bonus action. Okay. Okay, so it did not hit that one, even though that one was glowing. Now, it's not going to let me use heal this time. Let's see. Okay, so it can only trigger once per turn. Okay. Great weapon master, or whatever. Okay. Uh... I should have raged and then attacked, I think. I don't think it's going to matter. Victory awaits. I guess this is fine. I mean, I could do this. It's a deck save. Honestly, probably not going to work on what's-her-name super well. So I might as well, because she's got 19 decks, so... Is saving just a little bit of damage worth it? Probably, probably. Oh, real? One? <laughs> Okay. Time to strike. Time to push my luck again. Three damage? Is it a percentage damage? Dude, that's... That's goofy. I mean, I swear, this thing, it did, like, 50 damage <laughs> in the pre-patch when I, the big spider was sitting on one of these. Yeah, come on up here, you coward. 
critical hit. Venomous Discharge. Wait, what was it before? It said they rolled a 20. This is phrased differently, all right. I need a 17 to save, so that's probably not gonna happen, but I did stop a crit. Oh, wow, actually, is it one shot? Are you serious? Wait, what the hell were all these? I thought I just killed a bunch of them. Dex proficiency save in 16? Dex, right? So it should be plus 3. Plus. So I should be getting 10 plus 5. So I should need a 15. It said I need a 10. Maybe their ability score or whatever is really high for that. I don't. I can burn that web and send that thing falling down again, but that means it's going to get another shot on me. advantage on this weapon enchantment off balance oh because it's off balance just had to not roll a one. Okay, I guess I'm just gonna use this as a bonus action. I need to get a menacing strike on that thing. Shut it up, but this thing's gonna take a hit at me. I mean, do I care? Astarian should be able to. Well, I need to do the fire thing to knock it off first and see if it takes a lot of damage. Alright, we're going to take this as a bonus action first. Okay, and 
then we're gonna clap this. Oh, we can't do an additional bonus action? Okay, so you can't get double bonus, you have to choose. There's still one right here. Alright, learning mechanics. Did, oh, sh I already used all my bonus actions here. Okay, well, someone's got to get in this thing's face. I think. I'm going to stand, like, right here. Well, it's telling me it's going to get a shot at me if I do that. So, these two don't have any actions left. Care that that I just gotta stop that thing from firing. Astarian, I think I can catch this thing on fire, then do two shots and um, kill these two on my next round. He comes right after me. I don't know why I don't have them all in a row here. Okay, yeah, I. I don't want to be grouped up for, like, a poison spit, either. Actually... Do I want to use a repost and kill that thing, or not? I think I'd rather use a power dice on the big spider. And just use an offhand. Okay, so I'm trying to go right here. So that if I burn this web and knock it down, if this thing teleports up, it's going to be in melee with Lazel, And it won't get to fire a range shot. That's what my thought process is here. <laughs> How much was that? 59.44? It's 59 total, and it's not prone for a turn. There we go. So I guess it's a percentage of their health. Now, if it zips over here again and causes a bunch of problems, that's gonna be... it's gonna be bad. Just kind of stay a little spread out. Starion's for real, man. I can still throw stuff from up here and keep my rage on that spider down there if I have to. If it doesn't get up from prone. I think it'll get up, though. Bro, what? What is the range on this? Like, it's able to get up in literally one turn and teleport to a place it can't see that's like a hundred meters away? Bro, what? Disadvantage on attack rolls and ability checks. It's still...
Lightning Strike or Frenzy Strike? Maybe I can knock it prone. Alright, I need to do the uh, Reckless Swing, I think, first. Ten? I guess I, maybe I should have had Great Master or whatever with it. I should have done the Great thing with it, so it does extra damage, but... Alright. Well, can this... Fifty percent. It might knock it prone, though. What was the other percentage with the... That's doing way more damage, though. I think. 51. bonus actions. Can I hit this thing? Or I can jump up and auto it. I need him just to pick people up, I think. So on his turn, I can pick her up and then double shot. I think that's what we need to do. And right here, I need to just jump over. Doesn't cost a dice if we miss. Oh, God. I mean, the thing does have high dex, but. Have we already used a double action? No, we haven't. Do I take a 30 percenter here? I mean, it's probably going to kill Lazel next turn. Or it's going to try. So I may not get another good shot at it. Let's just do it. Honestly, oh, it's because I'm disadvantaged. Yeah, all right. Well, if I'm disadvantaged, anyways, I might as well just bring her up. Now I need to spread the hell back out so I don't get splashed. Starion's kind of looking like an MVP, I'm not gonna lie. This fight, anyways. That's with Sharpshooter all in, too. Still got 50%. I feel like that has to be bugged. It shouldn't be that high. I mean, I missed two other shots. I've missed a bunch of stuff that was kind of troll. Like that 5%er swing. I'm not standing in Toxin, am I? Or am I? Can't tell. Okay. 
That shouldn't be right here. Hopefully, please don't zip over here. I mean, she's going to get two opportunity strikes if she does that. Zips over here and busts these eggs open. to run right through? Bruh, that's pretty troll. Okay, what is this? Resistance to physical. How long is it enraged? I don't remember it being enraged for this long of a period of time. Frenzied Strain now also applies to throws. Can she take an action this turn? Of course not. Oh, I can do this, though. Disadvantage. I mean, she's going to one-tap me anyways. I mean, I could throw a potion of greater healing if I get a full move back. Forty percent chance. I think that's literally just to hit, though. I mean, what else am I going to do? Okay, so it is actually ensnared. Okay. Now we've got advantage. That would cause fear. So it can't move and we'll have superiority dice and stuff on it. I think. Or do we go for her first? Oh, uh, that's because I've got the clap uh, activated here. The big damage. We take off the big damage. 75%. Might need to just go for the big damage, though. I mean, that could knock her prone as well. 70%. Versus just a normal swing, seventy-five percent. Now this does eight to eighteen. Five to fifteen. It's not telling me exactly how much it does. It might do some splash damage, too. I can't remember. Alright, I'm just going to do a normal attack, I think, to it. Lacerate is also 8 to 18 with Bleed. Please, for the love of God, can we just catch a break on this fight? Like... Gotta go for frenzy strike again, I guess. Seventy-five 
six. I mean, I guess it does have physical resist. Jesus. Okay, maybe I do need to get a magic person in here. Well, pop potion. I don't know if it's gonna save me. These old poison pits everywhere, man. What? All right. Venomous bite. I need a seven. What? I just caused them to miss one thing. I mean, they're gonna kill her if they hit her. I gotta try. Hold up, hold up. Disadvantage on ability checks and attack rolls. And it just said I needed to roll a 17 to save off of an attack? It's disadvantaged. Man, they have really spiced her up a little bit, huh? So does she just like ignore status effects or I'm just extremely unlucky? we not have any more literally like no more potions does he have potions let me see he does have potions can I do this in combat okay I mean that Interesting. I think I can hit both of them. So I should have sat next to each other. Okay, with her, I think we just gotta keep cranking. With Lazelle, she is also threatened. So I'm wondering if I move with Lazelle, like right here. Now, I could jump to right here with Lazel, but then I wouldn't get any attacks. Come on, she's... I've missed so many little bullshit shots against her.
Can I not move? I guess that's too simple toxin. Alright, I think we're just gonna have to jump over here. I'm gonna be jumping right into that toxin. Maybe right there. Jumping right on that freaking toxin. I guess I can jump right here. And then do a heal. I can't get a triple heal here. But I can get a Starion up. And then he has bonus actions. And I could throw and like on her and get a heal maybe. Or I could get her up. But I need him with the bonus actions. Because I can't take a real action. Still frightens too, in theory, for a turn here. But then with a Starion, I might be able to. Am I still. Th I'm still threatened. With a Starion, I might be able to, like, heal her and. them, maybe. I need to clap this thing, but I also need a high percent chance. I mean, it looks like I have a 20% chance to hit him anyway, so I don't know. Maybe I should just be going for big damage. Um, nice. Okay, bonus actions. I can jump away. Now, she can, like, spider dash over, though. I can jump away and get her up with my... No, I don't have a, a real action. Um, can I throw? Throwing is a real action. Okay. So, I've got to just, like, jump back and then just take a shot at it. Maybe it dashes over to kill me again. I'm not sure. If I can stand next to her, maybe... What? What the fuck's happening? What just happened? What just happened? What just happened? I literally just jumped with Lazel. Is that the problem? Did I accidentally click in turn? Dude, that's got to be bugged. I had the cursor right there and pressed jump. Was it a reaction to a jump? I've never seen that. A reaction hit to a jump? I just did it with Lazel. And how did it get to hit multiple people? It took its turn. It acted like that was the end of the turn, was that jump. Sorry for the F-bomb, but Jesus. Like, what was that? I literally don't understand that mechanic. Obviously very frustrating. Whoa, 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 no, I meant to throw it. God, dude, if that ends my rage because I didn't take any damage, I'm gonna be real sad. What? 
That would, if that's true, that's just a misclick on my part. But that other one with the mechanic, I don't understand it. Oh my god, and she just lost her frenzy off of that. It doesn't let me jump? It let me jump with Lazel? What is happening? <coughs> what? What? Did it require... Does it require some sort of like... I don't know. Strength check or something? I'm so confused on this. I mean, I can throw this and wake both of them up, potentially. I guess I have to do that. I, what other bonus action do I have? Pummel, I guess? Tears protection? I mean, I guess we just have to throw this. Freaking misclick that earlier. Alright, it says it's gonna hit both of them. Right? They're both highlighted. That hitbox is, like, super sketch, though. There should be no disadvantage. Why am I disadvantaged? keyboard's about to go through the window. Alright, well clearly we're gonna have to reset this fight. I got, this. I got trolled like two or three times. The one was a misclick on my part. This thing has like a 10% chance to be hit or something too. I mean, honestly, not, like, insanely bad. I mean, maybe I can get a double... Who has the potions? You see, like, every potion of greater healing that I have. The indicators are freaking bugged. disengage see now it's saying it's not gonna let me jump like all of a sudden like I haven't been jumping the entire game it's disengage like a main action Cloaking's not going to do anything. 30%. Is that including my big shot? I mean, I guess I just have to do it because the dagger just doesn't do anything. I mean, I know it's 30, but, like, two of them should be 60, right? I don't know. These percentages, that's just the nature of percentage stuff, though. It's like sometimes you just get trolled. Wait, do I have more actions? And 
Oh, somehow it's letting me like click on her even though I don't have actions. Okay. They're still down. This is gonna feel good. I will ascend. Oh, I just got up, so I can't do anything. She can't do anything. So you can hit him with potions. <sighs> really wish I didn't lose my frenzy off of what I thought was throwing a potion that I guess was apparently taking it and wasting it. Is it... The spacing is kind of becoming a problem. Okay, can't take a main action. Guess I could have used some big arrows or something, but... I don't know why he can't jump out of range. No bonus actions that are any good here. I don't think we can just... Go. What does she have as a bonus? I mean, this awareness thing... I mean, I gotta throw potions on both of them and then just... I guess that's what I gotta keep doing. I mean, who has bonus action so that we can actually do? She's got nothing. Who hits harder? Probably... Well, she can maybe cause fear. Yeah, why has Repost not been an option? I guess because she hasn't missed. Okay, let's just throw it with her again. Get her up with Lazel. Because if I can ever put this thing to sleep with like Tasha's. I just gotta pray that occasionally it doesn't have a 100% hit and I have a 100% miss, I guess. 
Does this frenzy crap ever fall off of this? I mean, I could take one of these myself, but I really need to, like... Man, if I could get Atasha's off, if they don't hit her, and I get Atasha's, and I group them all up, and can throw a big potion on them, maybe. Although, she pretty much one-taps almost anybody. Yeah, the thing is just keep plugging away. This is just, like, unbelievable. That's 150%. Finally, 180%, I get a hit. Yes. Thank God. Now, I could pull her up, too, but I think if I get Tasha's, it should give me advantage. Holy crap. I'm heating up. Could get a triple heal. Or do I just like clap it? And just try to I think I just kill it, right? Advantage, massive hit with fire. And then I've got a star in with two shots after this. Thank God. Man, I was getting trolled there. Attention. That's how you earn a long rest, I guess. Holy cow. There better be a soft bedroll in my near future. <laughs> I agree, Historian. You earned it, buddy. Jeez. <laughs> They're all looking all roughed up there. I didn't realize that their face and stuff like that changes. She's just like, I'm good, guys. That their face changes um, based on different things. Now, this toxin, if I step in this, I'm going to take damage. So I guess I have to loot everything with her. Okay, that's going to be it for this episode, my god. Okay, that was a long one. I did not think it was going to take that long, but um, thank y'all for sticking with me. Sorry, dropped a couple F-bombs, got a little frustrated in there. We did that without hardly any resources, and with some pretty troll stuff going on. Um, I mean, that's the good thing about these physical damage dealers, is they don't need a lot of resources. Um, just the rage charge, but you get three or four of those. One per fight. And then Lazelle, short rest, give you back all of her battle tactics. And then Astarian is just a beast with Thief, because if he, if he goes down and you pull him up, he still gets his bonus actions for double shot. And I feel like it's bugged or something, because even with the minus 5 to hit plus 10 damage, he regularly is at like 50% or plus to hit on his shot. So I don't know, but I'll take it. And then Feronia was kind of worthless this fight, but to be fair, she's almost completely out of spells, has no bardic stuff, um, but she did hit a clutch Tasha's there at the end, which made this thing vulnerable to attack, and ultimately led to that huge clap with the Avernus strike, but anyways, okay, well that's going to be it, thank you very much, hope you enjoyed it, be sure to like and subscribe if you did, uh, it was a great fight, and I'll see y'all next time.